Alright, ladies and gentlemen, what's up? What's going on? It's your boy Joe. Today I'm bringing you guys a video on why, in my opinion, why I think that Call of Duty Infinite Warfare is fucking trash. I believe that people hate it, and why people believe that it's the worst COD to ever be created. Now, I can't agree with some of the shit here. Now, don't get me wrong, I do like a IW, but just there's way too many problems for me to actually sit down and play it for long periods of time, so. I'm gonna go over the fucking shit that people don't like about the game and why I believe that it's fucking trash, me being a COD player, you know? So, let's get straight into the fucking video. So first off, and most importantly, it's a futuristic COD. People don't like that shit, right? People haven't liked futuristic COD since AW. Now, remember, I mean, I don't know if you guys remember, but during Ghost, people hated Ghost. Right? They were like, what the fuck is this? Seems trash. People hated Ghost. They hit that shit with their lives, right? And they and they were like, oh, COD is the same shit over and over again. You know, it's, it's not even changing anymore. And then they brought, that's when they switched it up and brought AW into the picture. And people were like, oh shit, this shit is crazy. Like, before the game actually released, people were like, oh shit, you know, this game, it's a new COD. It's, it's, we're using exosuits instead of actually being on the fucking ground. And it's gonna revolutionize COD. People didn't like AW. Now, for those of you guys who don't know, I, AW is my favorite, no, no, not my favorite, my second favorite COD game ever. Uh, I, like, I just like the way the game plays. I feel like AW was the way to make a futuristic COD, right? Like, the movement for, for futuristic COD should have been like AW. AW had the best movement for a futuristic COD ever. Like, you could dodge and shit. It was amazing. Like, fucking... I don't like the fact that, you know, we have thrusters in, in IW and shit like that. And I feel like people just really don't like futuristic CODs in general. Because not a lot of people are good at them. Because it takes a lot of fucking, like... If you want to be, like, at a, at a really good level of... Of like a COD player then yeah you you gotta be fucking moving around and shit you gotta be doing a lot of shit to be fucking you know to be good and to do that you gotta be pressing A to fucking you know jump up and shit and this is just way too much shit you gotta be holding A while you fucking shoot there's a fuck ton of shit that goes to it and a lot of people can't do that um, you know and that's why people buy scuffs for example um, but Futuristic cars have just never been what the people wanted, you know? People just... When BO... When BO... Alright, let me tell you. When BO3 was announced, I fucking... I was like, hell nah, bruh. Because I didn't like BO2. Now, I know, I know a lot of people are going to be like, what the fuck, you didn't like BO2? Nah, I don't like that shit. I don't like BO2 at all. Maybe if I give it another chance, yeah, but... As of now, I don't like that shit. Uh... BO3, when I first heard that it was going to be a futuristic COD and it was going to be a, like a black off because I told you, BO, I love BO1, don't get me wrong, BO1 is fucking amazing. BO2, I, I just didn't like it, right? And when I heard that BO3 fucking three was going to be futuristic, I was like, no fucking way, dog. Like, this game is going to be trash. This game is straight going to be fucking ass. Like, this game is not going to be good at all. And I got my hands on it and it's... An amazing fucking game. I'm not even gonna lie. It's a good ass game, and a lot of people like it. And people regard it as the best futuristic COD. Me, in my opinion, I, I, as I said before, AW is probably the second, my second, um, or my favorite fucking futuristic. Sorry if you can hear background noise. I don't know what the fuck my mom is making. <laughs> uh, oh, sorry if you can hear my my chair squeaking too. My bad. It's just fucking trash. But where, where was I? Oh yeah, the BO3 shit. So BO3, remember, was a futuristic card and it was regarded, you know, I, I, I looked at it as like, this shit is gonna be trash, like it's, it's straight gonna be trash. And I did, I did pre-order it, but I was like, you know what, it's from the trailer, from me viewing the trailer, I was like, this game is gonna be terrible. You know, cause in the trailer it showed like swimming and it looked whack as fuck, bro. Like it looked trash. I was like, there's no way this game is gonna be good. And it's fucking amazing. It's probably one of the cards I spent the most amount of time on. I'm like level 400 and, well, I'm level 400 and something, so Master Prestige level 400 and like 60 some. So you can tell that I put a lot of time into that fucking game. Yep, I definitely one of the CODs that I've grinded out the most. But then we get to IW, and I feel like people got tired of 
two futuristic cousins in a row and were expecting something different like i was i was definitely not expecting iw i was expecting like mw4 or maybe another title and you know when i first heard iw i was like shit it's it's fucking infinity ward like infinity ward has never disappointed me to be honest like there's not an infinity ward game that i don't like even now like iw i like it but it's definitely one of the worst cards ever to be fucking created maybe even the worst like no bullshit um i feel like people just got t like got tired of the futuristic shit including me like I was like, come on, like uh, another futuristic card, but I was like, fuck it, I'll give it a try, because I mean, I, I was, I fucking, I judged the book by its cover, the fucking BO3, I was like, nah, this game's gonna be trash, and it, and it turned out amazing, so I was like, maybe that's gonna be the fucking case with IW, so I was like, shit, this game's gonna be fucking good, like, fucking, let me just, you know, try it out, nah, not really, and people didn't really like it either, you know, so let's just get away from that futuristic shit. And let me let me kind of talk about the other fucking factors on why people maybe don't like this game. Another fact, well, I mean, why I don't like it are the variants in particular for multiplayer. I fucking hate variants. Variants were introduced in the AW, and it was the shit that I hated the most about that game. Right? Remember, this is my second favorite card, right? I love everything about AW besides the variants. I fucking hate the variants. If you guys don't know what I mean by variants, are pretty much guns that give the the player an advantage over. A regular gun so there's I right, let's let's say there's an AK 47 right and there's an AK 47 that adds three damage that someone has and uses that shit in multiplayer while there's another person just using the regular AK that pretty much compared to that one has three minus damage right it's like bro you're not gonna fucking win a gunfight against that dude because he's clearly gonna outgun you because it's it's a pay to win. I hate that shit, bro. And you see that shit all the time on IW. Everyone uses variants. Now, I don't like using variants because, one, it's just not for me, bro. I hate using those shits. Like, I just don't. I feel like I hate on them. And I don't want to be that guy that, that's a hypocrite and fucking hates on the gun. Or hates on the variants and then uses variants. You get me? Like, same shit goes. Uh, all right, so the next topic is the, uh, the robot, which... I'm not really sure what the fuck it's called. I think the synaptic. I think that's what it's called on IW. It's a special. Uh, uh, yeah, it's a specialist on IW. It's a, pretty much a fucking robot that's skinny as fuck, and the hitbox for it is unbelievable. Like you can't hit this fucking thing if it's flying, bro. Like straight up, if it's over here, like thrusting around the fucking sky, you can't shoot that damn thing because the hitboxes are trash. And what pisses me off the most is that. Infinity War doesn't do shit to fix this fucking robot like it's been broken ever since the game was released Broken to the point where it got banned for pro league like pros can't use this fucking robot because it's broken Right, so if that if that doesn't tell you some shit like come on I fucking infinity War. like fix this damn robot. It's trash, bro It's it fucks up the game so much and it, compared no no well fucking Combine that with a fucking variant, bro. You got an unstoppable little kid on fucking Adderall, you know, just fucking flying around and murking everyone because he can't get shot. And he's got a gun that pretty much just destroys everything. And I f that's one of the reasons why I hate this fucking game the most because of that shit. Like, it's just, it, it pretty much is a pay to win game. Nah, nah, it's not a pay to win because I know there's, there's games where pay to win is taken to a whole nother level, but. Cause, yeah, I mean, kind of. Cause, I, I don't have like OP ass variants. Cause I don't, I, I think you can make them actually, but I don't make them. You know, I, I don't, I don't have any of those beast ass variants. I just have like the regular ones that give you like one extra clip in the fucking mag or some shit. Like it's just some shit. You know, you, you get me? Like it's not. I don't have crazy ass variants that these kids have that give you more damage, give you more headshot damage to get these fucking advantages. I just go in there and fucking play with regular shit that I got, you know? So, next up is a problem that I have. I don't know if it's only me, all right? It seems like it's only me, but my internet is fine. Like, I don't know what the fuck is the fucking servers, bro. Like, every time I hop on the IW, where the time, the rare times where I actually feel like playing the damn game, I always get fucking booted off the servers. The servers are terrible, bro. I don't know if it's only me that that shit happens to, or if it's like some shit that, that just happens to everyone in the lobby, but I swear to fucking God, every time I'm playing, and I think I, I will have gameplay, like playing over my voice, so I'm not really playing right now, I'm just talking, 
but I'll have a fucking I'll have gameplay in the back but I'm pretty sure I, will, I do have gameplay where I get fucking kicked out of the game like the game legit just stops it freezes my shit and then I got a fucking it kicks me out the servers and it tells me that there's I've been disconnected from the host or some shit like it doesn't make sense like the, I've always had problems with servers on this game like actually not, not always like when the game first came out it was perfect even like after a few months but like recently when I've tried to play it the servers have just been terrible bro like I haven't it's just I don't know what the fuck it is I don't know if it's only me it seems like it's only me but I don't know why it would only be me you get me like it's fucking stupid but other than that you know let's just get straight into the next shit is I feel like they, they did a pretty stupid ass job it's pretty dull with like what they did with the specialists in my opinion the specialists aren't really that good there's only six which I mean there's six but then there's they they each have three abilities right on BO3, there were nine, ten if you included, uh, what was that fool's name? Fucking Blackjack or some shit? Uh, but Blackjack really, he isn't fucking, you know, I don't consider him an operator, like, or a fucking, an operator, was his rainbow fucking specialist, you know? But he is a specialist, so there's nine main ones, right? And they all had a weapon, a specialist weapon, and a specialist ability, and... Oh, fuck, I think some on IW have two weapons. Wait, no, no, no. I think they have two abilities, and I, it might be mixed. Some of them might have two weapons and one ability, and some of them might have two abilities and one weapon. It's kind of weird to, to explain it, right? But pretty much what they did was take everything from BO3, or pretty much they took every single like specialist weapon and ability from BO3, and they just put it on to IW. Like, it, they really didn't fucking try like it's kind of stupid bro like all the abilities you can find on bo3 are found in fucking in iw pretty much all of them same shit goes with the weapons like it's just like a reskin or a different name that just of uh, the fucking weapon or ability like it's kind of stupid how they didn't even try to make new operators or new specialists and i feel like if you're gonna make a a, a card that has like specialist you know at least fucking change it up like come on i want to try some different shit like not just the same shit that i played i played i'm telling you i grinded the fuck out of bo3 like i already know every single specialist inside out like what the fuck like i don't want to use them same niggas just with a different fucking uh body type or some shit like come on bro and let's just get straight into the last one which is there are no good smgs on this fucking game and that that's a problem that's a problem to a lot of people because smgs are one of the most popular if not the most popular gun category that you can fucking find in a cod you will always find people running smgs on cods bro smgs are it's like playing fucking gta with no cars bro it's like what the fuck like it doesn't make sense you get me like SMGs need to be in the game and the fact that there aren't any good SMGs don't get me wrong the SMGs kill no shit they kill but there's you're better off using an AR like the ARs in this game pretty much like the K bar is pretty much a SMG right the Envy is like a long range AR and the K bar is the SMG that you use and that that's what's kind of stupid you get me like even nah nah even before like on BO3 there were SMGs that, that people, that pros would use in, in particular, and ARs. Now, you rarely see pros using SMGs. And that's true, because SMGs are fucking terrible. They only, they're only useful for some maps. Like, on BO3, you would watch pros, like, run SMG on every single map. Like, Skump, for example, one of the best SMG players in the goddamn world. He used to run SMG on, like, every fucking map. It wouldn't matter. Now, you have to, like, know the map in particular to use an SMG on. Like, it kinda sucks that, that, that that's the fucking, you know, the, the way that this shit is played. As I said before, SMG players are like some of the most popular players. Like, you will always catch people using SMGs on CODs. Like, go back to MW2s, people using SMGs. Go back to AW, go back to BO3, go back to every single COD, there's people using SMGs, right? Like, come on. Like, SMGs have to, you know, SMGs need some love too. But other than that, I feel like those are the reasons why IW is fucking trash. Why it's why people don't like it at all. Why it's one of the worst CODs ever. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like. Uh, subscribe if you want to. I'm not gonna fucking force you to subscribe. What the fuck is my controller? Oh, here it is. 
Uh, but yeah, I'll see you guys later. Have a good fucking night. And peace. Yeah, see you guys in the next video. Later.